Good morning, guys, from Juno. It is a brisk 55 out. I think it's gonna get about 65 degrees. This is our view. I don't know, I don't think that's technically Juno. I think that's the opposite side. Maybe it's still considered Juno. I'm not really sure. Um, but whatever town that is, it's opposite of Juno because we're on the opposite side. Today we have the sled dog measure camp and we get to go see sled dog puppies and high skis. And I'm so excited. And if I could take one home, I would. And we are in port from seven to one. We have to meet onshore at 9.15, so we got to go eat now and then get off the boat in a timely manner so we can meet onshore by 9.15. I don't know what the shopping situation looks like here, but we'll figure it out. We'll probably see once we're on the opposite side of the ship. And then we've got a fun reservation for tonight um, for a place to eat. And I think that's it. We might do book for cars if they still have it tonight. We were going to do it last night and then we forgot about it because we are tired. And then also we can't, while we're docked here, none of the shops apparently downstairs can be open. I think that's like a legal law thing that they've just done with the ports. But yeah, I'm going to go now so we can eat and I'll see you guys in Juno. Jacob, how do you feel about this? Yeah. We're shopping. Ooh, what's in there? Yeah. We're shopping in Juno and check out this view that we've got. Isn't that crazy? I think it's crazy, but we gotta go to our tour now. We're gonna go see some husky puppies. While we wait, check out our cruise ship. Look how big it is. stop is about 20 feet further uh, but throughout the day Nuggie likes to inch further and further back Which so one's he, the black and white lead oh, dog uh, he likes to pee on every Here we go. <laughs> and you can 
guys. And then if anyone wants hard. any good photos with the dogs, this Hi. is also a really good place to grab it. I know. Hi. Oh, you like me? That's Gandalf right I like there. you too. Hi, Gandalf. Hi, buddies. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm trying yeah. to get it off. I'm trying to give you attention. Nobody gets Rudolph. Though, Hi. Right? There is no Rudolph. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be too, too much. You good yeah. puppers. You said to good puppers. Oh, look at Jacob. Oh, what? You smell oh, bon buns. You getting jealous? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we, uh, the dogs have folks right here on site, so we're here with the dogs. <laughs> and then they have a house in town for the <laughs> bus driver. So. I'll keep it in use. I'll keep it in use. Um, so we've been bringing our dogs here for a couple of years. Before that, we went to a different one. Uh, Hi, I know. Yeah. Yeah, the Pretty. Hammer and strike. Hi, Hammer. Oh my goodness. Hi. Hi, Stripe. Hi. You're very pretty. You gave me a little nipple. <laughs> I think you won my favorite because you're like ADHD like me. He's a popular favorite. Him and Cheese. <laughs> cheese loves some butt rubs. <laughs> hey. What do I smell like, Bunny? I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> yeah, they like sniffing everybody. They like to know where you guys have been. <laughs> what are you Breakfast. doing? <laughs> <laughs> he screamed me. <laughs> I know. What do I smell like? Now I got complete dirty jeans. Look at the hair color. It's like almost red. Hey, look at what he did. <laughs> He was putting his paw on me. I know. <laughs> you look like you're tired. I think you need a nappy nap. Yeah, so they range from 30 to 70 pounds. So Hi. Bug doesn't look the like they want to do anything. Bug. Hi. Hi, Bug. That's okay. Hi, Bug. Yeah. I know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hi, Buggy Bug. You're just loving the attention. <laughs> oh, you're so sweet. Hi. You want the attention too? And then we have another minute, so if anyone wants any group photos with the dogs, we can grab those. You can pick your favorite. Are you sibling? Hello! Hi! I know, do I smell like bonbon? Okay. I know! Hi, guys! Hi! What? Oh, you're getting my phone. That's cute. Oh, you look tired, buddy. Whoop, I'm being pushed. Oh, no. <laughs> and there he goes again. Yeah. <laughs> Always with the same shenanigans. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> oh. Peppers, you can hear them. Look at them. Oh my goodness, they're paddling. She's like, what are you doing? <laughs> uh, that is Blackfoot. <laughs> Jacob, stand back a bit. There you go. Do they have names yet? Thank <laughs> you. 
It's gonna eat the camera too. Oh, where do you think you're going? Oh, this one wants to go down. That's a big one. Are you gonna take it? Oh, it's gonna eat my earring. Yeah, they're not quite as fun to hold as the other ones. The one that was holding the tree. You sit down. Glenn, realize we're going down. Glenn, wait. It's so cute. It's like, where's the other ones? Hey, baby. Hey. Jacob, do you want to hold it? Mm -hmm. Get under the butt. Mm. That one's like, I don't like this. It's like, I want to play. Oh my goodness, your face is so sweet. Oh my goodness. Hey, over here, your friends are playing. It's the ears for me. Sorry. Or you just my glasses. <laughs> you just gotta get some attention. You just gotta get some loving on. Good afternoon, guys. Um, we had a fantastic day in Juno. And I did clarify, sorry, I'm putting something out, that across the bay is also Juno. And that's actually where the Sled Dog Marsh Camp was that we went. That was so fun. As you guys saw, there's so many clips of that. We came back, we did a little bit of shopping. Like I said, my goal is to get something that says like every city that we go to. Tomorrow we have a cruising day. The day after we're in British Victoria and then we are in Seattle. We do a tour in Seattle then we go to the airport. Maybe I'll need to buy, we need to figure out if we're taking a train or a bus. We're not really sure. Is this still recording? Okay, it's still recording. But anyway, I wanted to show you guys what we got. And I did get things from my parents. So I will, I feel like maybe I did get ripped off for this, but whatever. Um, I'll show you guys what I got, my parents, and then Jacob can show, up, show off what he got. And then I'll show off what I got. And then we'll go to lunch because it's about like one o'clock. I just did my Stolero shot. So we'll actually probably go downstairs to the health and wellness center. I would give them just my single sharp spin container besides the fact that like they, when you dispose of it, it costs money. So I don't want just like one sharps in that bin. Um, cause they probably won't want that or accept it. So I'd rather just bring it down and have them dispose of it in one of their sharps containers, much easier. And then I'll just travel back with that things taking up space and maybe we'll put a few things in it that we don't want to break. Let me show you guys what I got for my parents. And I wasn't looking to get anything for my parents. Um, however, I kind of saw stuff and was like, wow, my mom would want it and my dad would want it. So for my mom, I got her this necklace. There was a, there was a shop that was like going into retirement or something. And so they were like, we'll give you everything for cheaper. And this lady was like, well, usually I'd sell it for 175 and then now it's in 195 but for your mom, I'll give it to you for 45 And I was like, okay. And it did say 95 and 175 on the tag, but this is it. There we go. I can't tell if it's focusing or not, but it's, when you turn this, it's like orange and purple and a little bit of blue. Um, it's just something that I think my mom, oops, I think my mom would really like. It has kind of a weird chain, but she can always change that. And then I saw this and I was like, this is so my dad. Um, we live obviously in New Hampshire where my parents do, I grew up there. And we have a bunch of bears and they always break into people's cars because people do not lock their cars when they're on vacation. You would think they would, they don't. Um, so I saw that and also my mom has a RAV4 and that's pretty much like a RAV4 car. So I was like, that is 100% my mom. Then I got this beautiful sweatshirt. Again, I've been trying to get long sleeves, but I got a sweatshirt. I got this beautiful, beautiful Juno Alaska sweatshirt that was only $20, which I think is a good deal compared to some of the stuff that I've bought at ports before that's relatively cheap. And then also another thing that I've gotten away with of late, um, shopping places is that I fit into kid sizes. So I've actually been getting the t-shirts that I got and have all been like six and eight dollars because I'm the size of a child, a large child. So I've got this one. Jacob, show me what you got. Hold it up. Jacob's sitting over here. First thing Jacob got was that shirt. He liked that. Mm -hmm. And then... I got this nice jacket. Jacob wanted a like, kind of fall jacket. He doesn't really have one. So Jacob, it's not yellow though. It's green. <laughs> um, he went with the saws up so that it could be spaced. And then what's that? 
What did you get? Shot glass. Ooh, ah. Uh, so yeah, I think that's it for right now. We do have a reservation tonight. Wow, I said that with a lisp. We have a reservation tonight at the Slayerian Bistro. It's just one of those things that um, we just kind of like want to eat there, but you need a reservation for it. Mm -hmm.